Running has helped me navigate through adversity and brought me to resilience again and again. And on August 13th, 2018, I got sober for the first time. In those first few months of sobriety, I was using running a lot as a physical tool to help me cope with this new normal. It could be one mile or an ultra, it really doesn't matter. I did Eastern States 100 to prepare for my daughter Colby's spine surgery. I thought if I could do Eastern States 100, pretty much anything else will seem easy after that. 12 days of recuperation in the hospital, a few weeks at home, turned into an infection and four months in the hospital, several trips to the pediatric intensive care, near death, medically induced coma. Anything I'd done in ultra running seemed so easy. Running is my meditation. It helps me when I'm frustrated, angry, or sad. I'm currently on my lunch hour from my work at a nursing home. Uh, currently here at uh, this facility, we have, uh, I believe, about 70 cases of uh, residents that tested positive for COVID. And of those 70, 15 individuals have passed away. It helps me celebrate when I'm happy, successful, or inspired. Mike's an inspiration because eight years ago he had open heart surgery to replace a valve and he kept on running. But now he's in the race of his life. Earlier this month, just before a long run, he realized that valve was failing. Now at age 52, this fit guy just had his second open heart surgery. As I film this, Mike is still in ICU with some complications. But he's strong and I know he'll get out on the trails again. I run to focus and to be spontaneous. I run to remember and to forget. I started meditating more and I was eating cleaner and I had a great support system through the running community that I had not found anywhere else. They taught me and I learned through my many miles on the trails and the roads that you're gonna have bad miles just like you're gonna have bad days. The beauty and uniqueness of nature uh, kind of lets my mind free. I think running those sand dunes and trails kind of represents life, so you're going to have your ups and downs. But if you're able to overcome those challenges, you not only become a better runner, but a better person as well. I run to stay grounded and to fly. Running like sobriety has taught me to be grateful for each new day and each new trail. And most importantly, it's taught me to enjoy the journey. I run through adversity, and that brings me to resilience. Resilience is what you earn through the experience of adversity that then comes into play the next time you have adversity. The next time you have adversity, you're more resilient. Right, Colts? <laughs>